Hey guys, coming to you today with another fall recipe. As you can see, I've got a couple of bags, actually a few bags of butternut squash because I'm lazy like that. Some carrots, coconut milk, got an onion, garlic, sage, Granny Smith apple, vegetable broth. I've got my peppers here, my dynamic duo, as well as some cayenne pepper, some cinnamon, and some nutmeg. So now we're just going to add everything to the crock pot. My two cups of vegetable broth, about three pounds of butternut squash. Next, I'm going to add in my garlic, onion, carrots, and the chopped apple, as well as my sage. So added in my spices, I'm going to go ahead and give everything a nice toss to make sure it's evenly mixed up. Okay, so now you guys can cook it on low for six to eight hours or high for three to four. I'm gonna cook this on high for three and a half hours. I just want the squash to be tender. Remove the sage, throw it away, stir in half a cup of coconut milk, and then I'm gonna start transferring it to the blender. Get it going. Stir it in the coconut milk. Time for the blender. Thank you. 